discouraged because I feel like my soul is taken away from me. It's hard to pray. I have no emotion, no any feeling to Where's do Where is your husband? Where is my? Husband. He's at home. You are with him? Yes. And what is your problem? With my... You are with your husband. We are disconnecting. You are disconnecting? Yes. I don't know if it's me disconnecting with him or we're both disconnecting, but I yeah, see a problem that, with That's him. the reason why you are failing to pray. Because, look here. Uh, how do you use the word disconnecting? Can you tell me the meaning of disconnecting? You disconnecting with your husband? Dis As for me, I think it's like he's... I am moving away from... I'm not myself. Me, myself, my emotions are not there. There's no feeling. There's no feeling in the heart. Look here, Sissy. You are the one who's causing problem. You understand? Yes. You're causing problem because... You know what your husband wants. Huh? Mm -hmm. So you don't need to look at your feelings. Look here what the Bible is saying. The, I'm just answering by the Bible. It says the woman's body belongs to her husband. And the man's body belongs to what? To the wife. So if you are going away and you still talk about your emotions, your affections, and you're the one who's going away, Bring yourself back. How? You understand? Yes. Allow this man to be your husband again. Huh? That, but but okay. if now you are trying to go away and say, I'm not longer feeling this man, and you are counting mistakes he has done, automatically you won't pray. Because the Bible talks about forgiveness. Yourself, bring yourself back. Go to bathroom, wash yourself, come clean. You know what your husband wants. Are you hearing me? Yes. You'll be able to pray. Mm -hmm. You hear me? Yes. But if now you look at your own emotions, I can't feel this man. What do you want to feel? I mean, you, you must get rid... Listen, I'm, I'm telling everyone who's watching our program. Everyone. A man is not created for the woman. It's the woman who's created for the man. I don't know if you're hearing me. So now, you as a wife, avail yourself. Don't say, I can't feel this man. No, there are times where you won't feel this man. Because you're not created... You are created for him. He must feel you. Oh. You must stop this thing, my sister. Go back to bathroom. Wash yourself. Now, I want to know if I'm not specifically speaking about my husband. It's like my soul is dead. No, your soul is not dead. It must start from the house. Charity begins in the house. It must start from home. Listen, look, look here. Like, are you a pastor? Yes. Eh? Yes. So if you're a pastor, you cannot preach a good message if you are failing to preach in your house. I'm telling you now, you must flow. When I come here, I'm flowing from home there. If I want to be, I mean, amazing here with people here, and I'm disconnected, they will be disconnected everywhere. So, sister, please rise up again. Be a wife. You know your husband. Be a wife. And then gather yourself together. Don't listen to your emotions, your feelings, whatever. Allow your husband to listen to his feelings and avail yourself and you'll be able to pray. Okay. Go and sit down. <laughs>